Alright YouTube, wasn't able to make a lot of videos on this frame repair. Try to give you guys as many as I could. It's been raining here in Ohio off and on. Customer needed his truck back, so I was trying to hurry up and get things done. But just wanted to show y'all the finished product. Uh, the customer ended up having to get a new Dorman replacement for this shock here. He said he found it at O'Reilly's Auto Parts. It was like $102, so this is new. The other one was so rusty we couldn't use it. Uh, comes with all new bolts, bolt hardware. Uh, the rear, rear section of the bumper here. I went and got new bolts from Tractor Supply Company because I cut the old bolts out. They were real rusty. But you can see all of the bolts are back in it kind of dark because of the undercoating. All of the bolts are in it. And like I said before, my main objective when I do these frames is to try to make the frame look as seamless as possible. Uh, you know, some guys take pride in their truck. They don't want really nobody to know that it's been altered or messed with. So. You know, when I do these frame repairs, I do my best to, you know, make my my repair panels and everything as seamless as possible. Of course, you're always, you know, you're always going to have some, some of your weld showing, but I try to, you know, make it as minimum as possible by me welding the front or the inside and the outside of every piece that I put into a frame. It allows me to grind the outside welds down a little bit more. Uh, but as you can see, uh, he actually used the dupla color. Uh, I think he bought this right here, truck bed coating. I usually use the cheaper stuff that they sell at Harbor Freight just because I'm cheap. But, you know, to each day on, this is good stuff. But me personally, I feel like they're all the same exact thing with a different label on it because this is exactly the same consistency the same smell everything is the stuff they sell at harbor freight but it did the job good uh but every every bar is replaced all the way around uh he actually went to the junkyard and found a new bar for up here so cut the rivets out this bar is bolted in so this is a new bar his old bar was bad I just want to give you guys an update on the Chevy truck frame. 